It's your time, it's his time, it's Ben's time, Ben's time to shine, your time to shine too. Yes, you. Hold on, let me make sure, my bad, y'all know this is a little too up, too, too up close and personal. Just gotta make sure, yeah, we gotta make sure we good. Y'all can see me well and all type of shit. We gotta make sure we good. We have today, why women are choosing this over their career. I guess the thumbnail showed like a, a, a woman holding children. So I'm pretty sure they're talking about like their family or whatever over their career. So let's hear it. Why are they choosing that over their career? What y'all think? Y'all think, do y'all think, a, ladies, because obviously the men probably, this is probably more of a question for the ladies. Do y'all think y'all should, it's important to, what, do you think it's important to be able to have that career woman or wife? Which one? Um, it says family balance of both and children make women happy, not a career. True or false? Let me start with the ladies here. What do y'all what do y'all think about that? True. Why do you think that? Um, I think that when a woman becomes a mother or has that family, she feels whole. Um, chasing uh, from what I've heard, those that have prioritized their career once they're like forty, they're like, damn, I wish I would have had a child. I wish I would have saw it and found a husband. So it's I true. think it's important for, well, I think for some. Um, that's why I said balance is needed. Balance is the key to life. Balance, and that's not just for women, that's for us too. Balance, bro. Balance, balance, balance. What you, what's very important to you, you're going to make time for. You got to balance that shit. That grounds them. Mm -hmm. okay. So for me, um, I lost my child in 2018. I had a C section. I'm sorry. And it's crazy because if you had asked me prior, it would have been like career. But I'm sorry. everything kind of changed when I had my very first ultrasound. Like everything kind of just stopped there. So I think, it, is, by the way. I think, though, thank you. I think careers are more fulfilling, not happiness, if that makes sense. It's more of like it gives me purpose. Like my career gives me a purpose of okay. doing something. Okay. But like my That's family, fair. my siblings, my boyfriend, like that makes me happy. That's like what drives me adds to your happiness you got to be happy before it adds to your happiness um i feel like true and false because i'm on the fence because i want a family one day and me personally i'm speaking for myself not for nobody else i want a family but i'm also like very like career driven so it's like true and false because that fulfills me to like i, I stay up late focusing on my business that like that drives me but then also if i had a family i would put 100 percent into that as well so uh, I can't is it because you don't have the family it's yet? It's because I don't have really the family. If I had the family, I, w I still would do both. Right. I, w I don't see why men be in relationships and still put 100% into their careers and still love their family, right? Mm -hmm. Women can do the same thing. We, we know that both could do the same but thing. But who wants to know when the first of the month is? Like, truthfully. Yeah, but that, what the, what, I don't get That's that. why they say, like, yeah, bro, it's like, you can do it, but... If the uh, it depend on this, every situation is different. It might be a situation when y'all both still kind of got to be in your careers. Maybe if you just had the kid, then you stay home with the kid. You know, you guys are good for the moment being. Then it gets the time. All right, it's been a year. All right, bet you know we got this person. You know, watching the kid now while I'm here. Then I come home, go get. You know, it's every it's a case by every case is different. Everybody shit ain't the same. What you mean? Like I like not knowing when the first of the month is. Meaning I like that my man. Takes but care of the bills. What does that have to do with family <laughs> or? Because I feel like I career. get a, I get a career to compete with others and put myself in a better position. Well, it depends like, on what your career. Nah, you get a career. Well, I mean to start, yes, but when you're with someone, you're in a career to add to what you have going on. It is like if your That's career is something that's your passion, like you love if you love what you do, then you're not thinking about. I love what I do. I was not thinking like I'm gonna be a hairstylist like when I'm a young girl. Would I was do just my hair doing for hair. Free? Hell no. Now, <laughs> hell no. Not now, but I have friends that I willingly do my friends hair for free because those are my bitches. <laughs> and I be wanting to experiment, you know what I mean? But if it's a stranger, hell no, I'm not doing that. But it's my passion. I would wake up and be like, I want to try something handy. Like, let's do this hairstyle. Yeah. That's how I know it's my passion, and I would do sure. it any day. Like, I'm never sure. going to stop. I respect it. You know what? So I feel true and false. If I had a family, I would put 100%, but I would still... I love my what I do like that's lit cause, cause right, you gonna so get bored you gonna get I, I feel like girls like you gonna, you're not gonna get bored like girls are talking about he gotta do like you're not gonna get bored of that shit you ain't gonna eventually wanna do something like you know like we can find daycare for you know that's what daycare is for then I go get them or whatever whoever go get them this day come home like you're not gonna get bored of just being out like come on man you, you gonna wanna go do something bro 
think to me this question is important because on this show a lot of times we have women who are so career driven and obviously they, they don't want the marriage they don't want the you know the, the family dynamic no for, balance for the most part is my career comes first no balance no nope. strong can't, independent can't deal and with be able to need a man and then like you said when they nope. don't get older that's when they start to value you know nope. the f- family aspect balance no balance can't deal with them no nope. more but that at that point it might be a little too late because you know what i mean now you're looking you're that's trying to flat. pursue something that is going to be really hard for you at that age. Like, you know Anything in life, I hate to pause it, but I'm going to do it anyway. Anything you do in life, bro, you need balance. It's just like, I'm trying to do this YouTube shit, right? I got to do this shit, right? I love doing it. But when I found out you could have a career doing this shit, I was on it. I got to get on it, right? I'm, doing, I'm working hard. I love this shit. I react to videos without even recording. I used to react, literally, I used to pause videos as I'm watching them on the TV, on, on, on the phone, whatever. And be like, bro, what, what are you talking about? Da, 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 da. Then I discovered YouTubers who do reactions. Reactions wasn't even super big at one point. But then it became super big. Podcasts. Love talking about certain topics, debating with people. I love creating films. That's what the other side of BAM is for, right? So boom, I'm on it. You get what I'm saying? Where was I going with that? Oh, yeah, balance, right? I have to make time for other stuff, right? I need a camera. Okay, that costs money. I need a new laptop. Okay, that costs money. Um, I want I want this particular outfit for this video on the on the on the sec on 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 the second channel. Okay, that costs money. Okay, you, I, I go to the gym to stay to, to stay in shape. I work out. Okay, that's that, that's gym membership. It's gonna cost some money. I need a haircut. Okay, that's gonna cost some money. Take care of take care of myself with the stuff my parents don't do for me. The, they provide a lot, but the stuff that I have to take care of my own. Okay, I need a haircut. Gas for a car. Okay, I need a haircut. Car insurance for a car. Okay, I need money for that. So what do you do? Okay, you go work a job. You go work a job in the field that you're studying. Maybe if you're in school, like me, I'm still in school. Or you just go work a job, right? But how are you going to make time to do your videos? You balance it. Okay, babe, put yourself in a position. Okay, you need to be making a decent amount of money, work five days a week. Come home from work, ain't no such thing as you tired. You have a video recorded that you already did, whether it's a podcast, reaction, or a vlog. You edit it if it's not already edited, and you post it. Ain't no such thing as, oh, I'm too tired, I can't post today. You're going to have a couple of those, but it shouldn't be a lot. Got to balance. You got to find, you got to, it's a, that thin balance. You got to get that balance to do the things you got to do. That's the problem. It's just, it's balance is everything, bro. I could put my I could be 100% on my career like nah ain't no way I'm not uploading that babe I ain't gonna lie she carrying the baby you had the baby for too long here L- leave her him with me you know what I'm saying I already got a video recorded or whatever what, but what can you do for me please I already have it the title the thumbnail everything just hit publish on there for me just go press the button or just upload choose that file then hit publish I already got the title and everything I wrote it down for you go do that now go now go relax I got the baby Balance. I gotta find time to make everything work. The, the, yeah, that's I mean, just how so, it goes. So, what are your thoughts on this? Yeah, I think so. The idea of like being happy is something that people kind of get confused mm. about today because we're we're all trying to be like happy all the time. Happiness is just, just a fleeting emotion. You know, happiness isn't fulfillment. Fulfillment and happiness are two very very different things. I think when a woman becomes a mother, she becomes fulfilled mm. in her life. And being, she ain't happy all the time. Right. The baby's crying, change of diapers. Right, right. Baby got sick, she's panicking, rushing to the hospital. She ain't happy right. all the time. Same with running a business, by the way. Yeah. You're stressed out. You got employees to pay. Things are screwing up. Like putting out fires all the place, but you're fulfilled in it. I think that's a that's a better measurement. Right. Right. Rather than just like. Say it's fulfillment, not happiness. Hmm. Okay. Does this thing make me happy? You know, I can get a TikTok blog, I'm happy for like thirty seconds. Right. Cool. Now, mm. there's no long term kind of. I heard that. Maybe for like 30 seconds. You're right. Cool. Other just like. TikTok, instant gratification app. Does this thing make me happy? You know, I can get a TikTok blob, I'm happy for like 30 seconds. You're right. Cool. Now what? You yeah. know? Yeah. Like there's no long term kind of future there, yeah. but having a kid, having, you know, being a mother, I think for most women, that is very much where they get their greatest fulfillment in life. Right. Do you. Do you because we, we spoke about this before about, you know, how the only people that benefits from being single and not having that family dynamic is ultimately the government. Because obviously the more people that's in the workforce, uh, the more people they get taxed, you know what I mean? Like, so do you feel like there's more of a narrative in today's society to push people to be single and not 
pursue that career? I mean, that family aspect. Yeah, I mean, I think I think there's a push to keep women in the workforce. Okay. Yeah, mm-hmm. I think there's a big, there's a definitely a, a lot of incentives that break up the family unit. Mm-hmm. Like yeah, incentives, like what you mean? Like, like as one example, that? like like alimony. Right, right, right. right. Yeah. Divorces going mostly in favor of women. Sectioning. Like, like you can you can literally plot this stuff on a graph like what f- prior to that happening divorce rates were minuscule right. in America yeah. mm-hmm. and then all this oh the welfare state kicks in bam divorces skyrocket right. you know I don't know if you know this but the, the black community in America had a lower divorce rate than the white community did right. prior right. to the welfare yeah, state. Also the most we do the bingo yeah yeah, yeah. absolutely yeah. then the welfare state kicks in and that completely flips on its head. Right, yeah, It's yeah. backwards now. So, like, yeah, yeah. That's because incentives. Right. Incentives mm-hmm. matter, man. People, humans respond to incentives. That's like, right. humans aren't these, like, per- we're not perfect machines, you know? Like, oh, everyone will do everything morally right and what's what's best for everyone else. We, no, we won't. Mm-hmm. We'll do what we're incentivized to do, really. That's what's right. Um, I want to interject because that's just, like, low-income housing, right? Like, if you apply and it's a, a man and a woman and they can have a kid together, but if they're not married you're less likely to get the apartment. But if you're a single woman and you have a kid, you're going to get the apartment. Right, definitely. But if right. you got your man in your life, they like, you know, right. you don't need it. Right. Low See? income what? See? Yeah. It's, so, a, it's, the, it's a, the wrong incentive, man. What the fuck is going on, man? Anyways, that's the end of this video, guys. You guys like this video, make sure to subscribe to the channel if you are new here. Rest in peace to Kari, X, my grandma. Spam the like button, and I'm gone.